Hello, my name is Robert Dixon with the Avaya Professional Services team. This video is about how to set up an IPsec VPN tunnel between two secure routers. For this configuration example, we will set up one end of the VPN tunnel on the secure router 1004. First check the system licenses support IPsec VPN encryption. Enter configuration mode and change context to interface Ethernet 0. Assign a private side IP address and set as crypto trusted. Change context to interface Ethernet 1, assign a public side IP address and set as crypto untrusted. Show the crypto interfaces. In our example, we will set up a default route with the next hop address 10.10.3.1, which is the secure router 2330. Access the crypto commands and create an Ike policy where the peer address will be the public IP address of the remote router. Enter a pre shared key and change proposal 1 to use triple DES encryption and Diffie Hellman group 2. Display the Ike policy just created. The response and initiate means the Ike negotiation exchange is peer to peer. The next step is to define an IPsec policy. Match the source and destination networks. Note there are two policies created, one outbound and the other inbound. In order to allow the Ike negotiations, we must add a new policy under Firewall Internet to allow inbound Ike services. On the firewall corporate interface, add a policy that allows inbound transit traffic from the remote site.
Finally, we will set up a firewall internet configuration to allow remote management of the secure router through the branch office tunnel. Thank you for your time today. We hope that this information was useful. We welcome comments, questions and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at avaya mentor. Thank you for choosing avaya.